Yes! Dominated reward! I want like a... I don't know, I don't have that button anymore. <laughs> I traded the MLG air horn on demand for better audio quality. So if I want to put that in, I have to edit it. So anyway guys, if you enjoyed this video, leave a like to like, say bye! Welcome to Jurassic World Game! I'm already leaving. Already, I've already given up. So we're playing Jurassic World the Game. And we have just managed to complete the Capra Sutures Gen 2 tournament, or it just came to an end. Uh, I think I did this, uh, you know, I thought last night, I was like, you know what? Maybe I'll actually get some rest today. You know, I'll get an early night. Why not? You know, and then I realized, I clicked on this and went, wait a minute. There's a Capra Sutures Gen 2 tournament. Do I even have that? No. No, didn't even have it. So, had to stay up till about like 3, 4 in the morning to, to do it all. And basically, here we are, and we have it now. So we also have a load of bugs too. Uh, so Capra Suit is Gen 2 now. At the moment uh, that I'm aware of, this guy doesn't have any hybrids. Or any super hybrids, anyway. I think I had a quick check. So we already seem to be on 209,000. Um, I, I, I don't know whether we always are, but I, every time I look at my VIP points, I'm always on 209,000. So we'll instant hatch it for 250 bucks. We basically got 500, so we can, you know, get two of them and get it to level 20 um and it not really be much of an issue hey 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 yes and look at all that brilliant uh so we've just restarted this so hold on let's let's do our lottery there was a chance for a card pack but eh. always worth doing it anyway just in case because if you do manage to get that card pack you'll get something good and you'll also get vip points for doing it uh so here it is gen 2 and uh, we get to level 10, 783 health and 245 attack. Already way better than a level 40 Capra Sutures. Because if you remember, level 40 Capra Sutures, the regular one, Gen 1, is only a super rare. So, Ludia have saved them so much, or saved themselves so much time and effort by just making uh, it again and changing its color and not even changing anything about it. I'm sure that it's, uh, it's level 40 will be the same model, just different colors, I'm assuming. So we also get some free food. This ancient crocodile has three sets of teeth, two rows on the top and one on the bottom. That's so. Well, you know what? It could have 20 teeth for all I know. I don't know. <laughs> they could say anything. Hopefully they check their facts after the whole Jim Kirkland uh, not discovering Utah Raptor incident, dear. Yes. So we haven't had any... Uh, one thing I did want to touch on. We haven't had any um, bosses for a while. Um, Salamander, I think, was the last one to unlock. Because uh, we have the Omega-09. We have Juggernaut. We have the Valkyrie. Hey, that's a streamer. <laughs> we have Salamander 16. Uh, so, we have a level 1 Salamander, level 19 Valkyrie, level 40 uh, Omega-09, and a level 28 Juggernaut. Now, each of them come with their own special abilities. But... I was made aware about a few videos ago that what you can do is actually just get them to level 60 or 70 or 80. I don't even know what it is. So if we click on new, so we can prestige it. So in order to prestige, you need 5,000 amber. Um, oh wait, unlock a new prestige rank for the creature. Oh, you just get 5,000 amber. And now we can go up to max level 50. Max level 50! Ooh! So we just get 5,000 armor. And we also get a new ability. So, pure... It's power... Sorry, pure. It's power move. It's pure move, Zeke! So at the moment, it only has revive, which is you gain one action point, and you get a free revive when you're KO'd, and you get 25% health back. However, when you prestige, I'm assuming you can do it twice, because there's two of them, um, you get primal roar. Deal damage equal to 250% of the attack power to opposing creature, and reduce attack of the target by 24%. And the final one, Roar of Champions. Increase team HP by 50% and increase team attack by 50%. You know what I feel like we need? If we're going to max up one of these, the Godzilla Rex. Because it's basically what it is. It's a Godzilla Rex. Um, so, should we do that? I kind of want today's episode to be this. So, we'll do that in a second because I kind of just want to go back in here. Because uh, we do have 10% off. So, what I'll do is I'll do all my instant hatcheries on this. Because I we don't, at the moment that I know of, need this just yet. So, if I can 
Uh, spend a thousand bucks on that. I'm happy. And then what we can do is spend six thousand on that. And instead of, you know, it would, so 250 bucks instead of 1,680. Now, what you've got to be careful of is when you're putting a dinosaur like this into an incubator, uh, it, it's always 250, depending on what, like, rank it is. Now, Oh, 10% battery. Oh, I love doing the battery. You know me. We like living life on the edge here. <laughs> uh, so even if it's a, um, a what you call it, a, um, ooh, a VIP creature, and that only takes five hours, it will still ask to instantly do it for 250 bucks, when really, it's only 100 and odd bucks. So if we put in a VIP creature, so let's have a look. I should probably have some Cenozoic VIP creatures. Um... No, I don't. Okay. Well, aquatics. Surely I've got aquatic VIPs. I must do. Did I put in all my VIP creatures? I must. Oh, dear. Okay. Uh, well, Jurassic. Surely I've got some Jurassic VIP creatures. Look at that. There's 27 of those. 13 should... 20... 25 Therizinosaurus. So much DNA is just waiting. Uh, no. Actually, no. I have Lithornax and I have Gorgo, but they're tournament creatures. So, uh, <laughs> you don't really have it. Okay, well, never mind. Um, so we do have that. Uh, so because we're getting 10% off and because DNA is... Ooh, it's a commodity to come by at the moment. We will go in here. We will buy one, but... Ooh, do I set it off for 10? You know what? Yeah, we, we've got four in. In a week's time, we'll have this done and then we'll have our instant hatcheries back. So if I really wanted to, we can probably just, uh, like, rank through... Uh, two creatures or one and a half creatures every week, basically. Uh, so we'll get another one and we'll get one more. Oh, we got the friggin, what do you call it? The trades to do. Heck yeah. So there we go. We saved, I don't know how much it was. It was 10% on each. So really we've saved 80% of DNA. We've always got a whole one for free. So, um, I think I have the free speed ups as well. Instant few. So we may as well do those. Um, I will save at least two just in case for whatever reason we need that for the other one what's it called the uh the omega so we'll get this to level 20 so level 20 1341 health and 419 attack and its saturation gets bumped up just a tiny bit yes so we're gonna get to level 30 but next week we'll get it to level 40 um right and i think maybe is that the best way we're gonna do this so every week we we can do a, a guaranteed like new creature uh unless something new comes out we could do like multiple episodes a week but it does seem like at the moment it's better just to have one episode a week because then we're showing so we're showcasing something new every look at the fps on this thing oh it's so good to see 60 fps <laughs> i love it i love it i love it um that's because we got a new ipad so we'll claim the next reward four thousand uh kappa sutures and kappa sutures gen 2 have holes in their jaw bones it's because there's no such thing as gen 2 <laughs> where teeth from the opposite side of the mouth can insert allowing their mouths to close completely well, I'd hope so. It must be horrible just walking around like... Ah. <laughs> so now we got them level 20. So we'll instant fuse 160 to get a level 30. So, oh God, we need to place that. That's right, because we don't have any more, do we? Yes, place it back down. Uh, so we'll get that up to level 30. 2,044 health and 639 of the... Now, it, it looks proper sunburned. <laughs> it's like a salmon. Look at that. You got nature's hot dogs in the back. Oh my god, it looks burnt. But it looks glorious, doesn't it? Lovely. Uh, oh, hold on. Yes, I want that little bit of fact here. So 100 bucks. Oh, thank you. And this Gen 2 hunts on land and its comparatively long crocodile legs allow it to charge prey with impressive momentum. Well, I'm glad. Uh, so we've done that. We also gained 150, which we are going to spend on getting friggin' Omega Prestige. Are you ready, guys? Our first ever in the entire game. This game's been out for seven years. I think more than seven years. Um, and we are now about to get our first ever level 40 plus dinosaur in the game. Omega 09 can now go to level 50. Okay, well, there it is. Yes! Lightning strikes! And it doesn't make a single sound. <laughs> 5,000 amber. New max level. Wait. That's just for this, though, right? Uh, prestige upgrade. Okay. And we got the raw. Right. So, hold on. So, it's only 100 to level up. 200, 300, 400, 500, 600, 700, 1,000, 1,050... 
I thought, oh my god, there it is! We can prestige again! So this time we get 20,000 amber, we get the Roar of Champions, and a max level 60. Heck yeah, let's do it. Yes! Level 60. That was so much DNA. <laughs> so much. Ooh, level 60. It looks so good though. I want it. I want it. Yes, and it doesn't change. I wish it changed the way it looked. If it just made it more like, I don't care. Scale it up. Pull out some of the spikes. Make it look different. Oh, but that really increase HP and attack for the team. That's really good. Now, if only I could use that in regular battles. Ludia, please let me play. Let me have fun with it. I'd love it. Um, right, so we will switch it to that power move. Um, I don't know what we get for that. Oh, well, not, nothing there. Um, and now I'm hoping we don't get any more dinosaurs come out. Any Because we've got the flyer, we've got the herbivore, the carnivore, and the amphibian. That's the basis covered unless we get omegas of, or alpha, or boss DNA of like a, which I assume they will eventually do, of aquatics. That's the only time I can kind of see us getting more at the moment. So I'm kind of happy to just spend it all on that to get it to level, well at the moment it's only level 50. And I, I'm kind of happy, like I don't need to spend any more if that means I unlock the move. If I unlock the move at level 60, so I have to get it to level 60, then I might upgrade it. But at the moment, I think we're good. So let's have a look to see what we can do with this. Um, so we have, oh, well, that's locked. So we need to do, we do one more battle to unlock time to strike, but we do have this. Um, it's only one though. What about this one? That's only one. So, and that's only one. So what's the difference? What, what's the difference in, oh, I level up my team's health? And attack when I have, I'm a team of one. <laughs> I feel like there must be other other ones. Um, defeat 19 opponents. I want to try and... Oh, this one has just opened up, hasn't it? Defeat 20 opponents. So what's got the better prize? So this one is just uh, dinosaurs. That's just dinosaurs. Oh, this one's cards. Heck yeah. I've got a level 50 freaking G uh, Godzilla Rex. It's 10 levels higher than what it should ever be. It's got 8,700 health and 2,500 attack. So we might as well just go for an attack, eh? We got 90 to get through. Now, bear in mind, this is one of the strongest dinosaurs in the entire game now, with that health and attack. Um, and, it's, and it can go up a whole nother 10 levels. We could probably get it to level 55, I think. Something like that. If we, if we, if we so wished to get it there. So we, all we need to do is defeat 19 enemies. Um, it doesn't seem so hard, especially seeing as a, we've defeated two. The third one has 55 health at the moment. So, should be okay. <laughs> uh, I'll go for three reserves here. Just want to get my reserves up, so we'll get seven on the next turn. Uh, we'll speed it up as well, just in case they just do decide to attack. Because I know we're running out of battery now. Um, so one, two, uh, I'll do three just to give myself the four. Uh, that's annoying, but at least we've got eight for next time. Um, I'm hoping, I mean, this is the one that gives the best. Uh, oh, hold on. This is, oh, have I done the wrong thing? I think I've done the wrong thing, guys. <laughs> this isn't like bosses be bosses. This is just a showdown. Ah, okay. Okay, you know what? We'll, gi we'll give up. We'll give up. My bad. Yes, roll on the floor. Bleh! <laughs> Why is it league? It's fine. We spent 30 bucks and we traded 30 bucks for basically 40 bucks. You run 10 bucks up? That's brilliant. Uh, no, it's versus, I think. No? Hold on. Uh, wait. Wait, no. No! 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 Wait, what? I, I, I'm, I'm not, I'm not confusing anything, right? No, this is how you do it. It, oh, oh no. Maybe it's time to strike. Maybe that's it. Ominous engagement. I mean, it, uh, that's defeat 20 opponents, defeat 12 opponents. We need to just do one of these and we should be good. Let's, what we'll do is we'll quickly do this one. Um, and once we unlock this pack, it'll give us another one towards unlocking that other boss event. And once we've unlocked that boss event, maybe that one is actually, you know, take on other bosses and stuff like that. I'm hoping? Because how does that, how does that work? I'm really confused. Because you you never have to have a cooldown with your, you know, your Omegas and stuff like that. Uh, so this one... 
I guess we do that, because it's still going to kill it in one hit, because I actually have Pelicanopteryx at level 40. I don't think I ever had this at level 40, but now I do, because it used to be Pelicanopteryx and the Kalilubibibus, that one that we used to do. But, uh, okay, okay, okay. We, we got a level 50, got a level 50. So all we need to do is just one more battle of this, and then we can jump in to the new one. Uh, so just do this, uh, yeah, that's just, yeah, I mean, that's it, I've got the perfect team now, every time I do this battle for food, I've got a dinosaur that can kill straight away, and then as long as they don't block, uh, for one, I mean, even if they block for one, I can kill them on the second turn as well, uh, they have to block for two, which they have done there, um, but even then, it doesn't matter what they do, because I kill them in one, and next turn, I have three, uh, so, and they did block for two, so that was the perfect way that, you know, it was the worst scenario for me, but I still was able to kill it in three turns max. So we get food, which I guess isn't too bad, because we do eventually need food, but really, it's 260 VIP points, which is really good. So now that's unlocked this Time to Strike event. So, what does this Time to Strike event do? Any three creatures? Yes! Yes! Okay, so this is it. Yes! Uh... So, right, I actually have a choice for him. So here we go. Right, let's go. So I don't know what... Oh, it's two Valkyries. Okay, okay. Every turn you get like a certain percentage, don't you? I think you get 20% towards your attack. Yes, he's on 20%. Okay, boss v boss. Level friggin' 50 boss meat. So if I... I'm just going to go for loads of reserves. Um, and then next time I should be on 60%. And I'll only need to put two in. And then I can do my attack which increases, so I can just increase my team, like, over and over and over. So that takes me to 60, uh, 7, 80, and then 100. Do the attack, so this will increase, I think, everyone's attack. Oh, look at it! Oh, that looked awesome! Sorry, I was, I sped that up there. Uh, so now we've got even more health, uh, and now we just got, you know what? I, I wonder if it'll increase 50% of my health that I've also gained, or whether it's base health. Because if it's also gained health, I could get to the point. What do you do? What do you do? I can't remember what this one is. What did you do? What did you do? I don't like it. Uh, what? Did it just get prepared? What does what does prepare do? What does prepare do, precious? Okay, that's fine. That's fine. I really don't know any any difference of what happened there at all. Um, but all I know is that it went for all of its attack. It went for max attack. Now we can do the- Yeah, look at this! Oh, that looks awesome! <laughs> yes! So, um, yeah, so lots of extra- Lots of extra health there. 11,000. So, he did prepare. So, does he get two extra reserves every turn? Oh, he might do! Yeah, he might get- Actually, okay, okay. So, still went for a lot there. Um, so we're just gonna spend four again. Two, four, six, eight. Yeah, we'll just spend four. Do our max attack again. Give us, I mean, it's not just me. It's the entire team is getting extra. So as long as more, uh, Godzilla Rex, more Rex, whatever you want to call it, just keeps on. Oh, yes. Yeah, it doesn't matter. It doesn't matter what I do. I can just keep on going. Uh, no, 5% low battery. No, don't give it. Okay, we, we gotta, we gotta finish this on 5% battery. So what, what are you gonna do, sir? Huh? What are you gonna do? I've given everything loads of attack. I think, right? I think I have. Whoa! I mean, I've got 6,000 attack. So, yeah. I think I just need to kill it at this point. Uh, that's not how you kill it. One, kills it. Factor in two. Uh, one, two, three, four. Do my big roar. And then I'll go for one reserve. So that no matter what happens, whatever comes in is... You know, it's in a good stead. It's in a good stead. So that's another 800. Another... Oh, 35,000 on the freaking Juggernaut. <laughs> oh, he blocked for two, but it doesn't make a difference because it's day. So does the other Omega uh, actually get its benefit of the prepare? I don't know if it does. Uh, no, I don't think it does. Um, he probably can kill me if he goes for four. It's pro yeah, it's probably gonna kill me. Oh god, what'd it go for? Oh, it went for its uh, free revive, I think it went for there. Oh, this looks awesome. So it's got a revive, it has an extra one for its reserve. It's probably gonna go- Oh, three? Is three enough? Oh, it's not! What are you doing? <laughs> I don't care at this point. 
So, uh, I'm just gonna go for four reserves and then I'll put in an extra. Oh, that's right, because I killed one. I think you get 15% or is it 5%? If you die, I think you get a whole 20%. So he's got eight at this point. Uh, he's probably gonna go for, oh, he goes for seven. Now it does have a free revive. So, uh, yeah, so unfortunately I don't because I traded that out. Um, but now here comes a Juggernaut with its 35,000, you know, really goodness. And Ale KO. Oh, yes. There it is. Don't know what this does, but I may as well use it. Uh, I think it gives me more attack. I think I get two extra attack. I think that's what it does. Right? Oh, I get one base. Okay, so uh, one. Two, well, we got two now. Uh, that kills it. I think it had one block, possibly. Um, and then I'll just go for... We'll, we'll, we'll pump up our attack by uh, 20% anyway. Oh, it does have it to revive. Oh, I completely forgot. Right, okay, so that kills it. But will it get back up? Oh, I've never seen it get back up from this angle. Oh, that looks great. Oh, look at that. That looks awesome. Look at all these unique animations, man. <laughs> this is sweet. Oh, these boss battles are great. Okay, so, yep. Does that count as an ally KO? I think it might have. Oh, it goes for six. That's not good. But 21,000, we're still okay. Right, so, uh, charge up. So I, oh, I get one every time, do I? Do I get one attack every time? No? Okay, never mind. Okay, so one, two. I'll, I'll factor in that. Uh, and I'll put another one in. Put another one in the charge. And uh, that's killed it. Whoabush, no free river for you, pal. However, the Valkyrie will be able to go for its, like, special, because it'll get, like, oh, oh, how did it just get eight? Excuse me? How did it get? Right, it doesn't matter what happens. I think we've won. I think we've won. I feel like the revive is just better, though. Like, having that free revive, and then just going for loads of reserves, and then attacking, and it doesn't matter what they do. Yeah, here comes seven. I don't know if that's going to be enough, though. Because it is a half attack. Oh, God, what's going on there? It had a weird triangle sticking out of its face. There's triangles everywhere. So let's go for it. Uh, we got our charge up. Uh, we've also got our turn. Uh, opponent KO. Oh, we're five off. I mean, does it make much of a difference? I don't think I increase my attack. I think all I do is I get, like, an extra attack. I think. I think. Charge up. Yep. Okay. Well, I still can go for eight. So may as well go for eight. Blocks for one, and this is gonna do so much damage. Woo! Now, the thing is, right, technically, the best creature in the game is Salamander, because Salamander's special is increase its armor by, like, so much percent. So if you do enough, you know, specials, it will get to the point where it will not be able to take any damage, and therefore it just basically wins, I think. So we are at 5%. Uh, we'll just quickly check what trades we got. Anything good? Some, oh, 245, heck yeah. Back to 3,000, sweet. Uh, we, oh yep, yeah, claim all of those. So now we can actually get the new Pelicanoptrix uh, super hybrid, I think it is. Because I've got that level 50. Um, oh yeah, that's right. I was gonna, did I not put one in? I thought I would have. It should be an amphibian, right? If we go to amphibians, go to the end. There it is, couple of sutures for 50 bucks. Heck yeah. Okay, guys, there it is. Short and sweet. However, we've done a lot. We've unlocked a new creature, got level 30, got a level 50 plus, basically, unlocked for a dinosaur, done a cool boss battle, and we've still got more to do. I kind of want to just do more boss battles. They look really fun. Uh, but if you enjoyed this video, leave a like, and until next time, I'll see you cuties later. Oh, bye bye